Evening, y'all. Sorry it's so late getting this capsule sermon out to you. I know it's, uh, it seems like we're always late and running behind, but that's just the way it goes. But um, tonight, I want to talk to you about temptation, about whatever it is in your life that tempts you to do sinful things, whether it's drugs or alcohol, whether it's lust, whether it's greed, whatever it is that drives you away from the Lord. I'll... I want you to know something. You are not alone. We all struggle with stuff. I don't care if you're the, the preacher of a Baptist church or you're whoever you are, we all struggle with temptation daily. But the good thing about that is, is so did Christ. He, he was tempted by the devil. He has gone through every single thing that you and I have gone through in his life that he spent here on earth. And we see that in the book of Hebrews. If we go to chapter 2, so Hebrews is in the back half of your Bible in the New Testament. If we look at the book of Hebrews, we go to chapter 2, and I'm going to read verses 17 and 18 to you. And it says, Therefore in all things he, meaning Christ, had to be made like his brethren, you and I, that he might be a merciful and faithful high priest in the things pertaining to God, to make propitiation for the sins of the people. For in that he himself has suffered being tempted, he is able to aid those who are tempted. So Christ went through the same temptations that you and I struggle with. He overcame those so the Bible tells us so that he could help us get through them. So no matter what you're facing, guys, no matter what it is in your life, if you'll turn to the Father, if you'll turn to Christ, he will guide you through those things and get you through it. And, and, and you, what a better friend to have there isn't. You can't find anybody better than Christ to lean on. I love you. God bless you. And y'all keep praying.